After years of planning, design, and public meetings, construction is now underway on a project to replace the YO-22 bridge over the Snake River just west of Jackson. It's a two-lane bridge that was built, oh, back in around 1960. So it's run its course, it's had its life cycle. This new bridge will be a four-lane bridge that can handle more capacity. The two-and-a-half-year project also includes pathways, wildlife crossings, and a redesign of the nearby intersection with YO390. Right now, we have two lanes going through this intersection, and it backs up traffic every day during the summer. Going to four lanes will greatly increase the capacity of that intersection and will alleviate the backup that happens every day. Crew spent late winter gathering and stockpiling material. Next up is work on the pathways. We made some commitments to make sure we did our pathway work first, so that way the pathway users, when the road construction happens, will have an easier time getting through. Along with that, we made a commitment to having a, an underpass on the west side of the project, so that way when the county brings their pathway paving through later on this summer, we'll be ready for it and the pathway can open up. It's a major project in tight quarters, but YDOT expects traffic impacts to be minimal. Because we're building two more lanes in addition to the two lanes that are out there, we'll build the roadway half at a time, just like we do for our bridge. That way we can main traffic on the existing two-lane road while we build the additional two lanes. Reminding you to slow down in work zones and always buckle up. This is Doug McGee reporting.